so you, yeah, you can tell. So he gave her the food, and now they're both just standing there. Muffin sleeping on the roof. Muffin, muffin, cute little fluff. Hello. I don't know why I always say hello in such a stupid way. I feel proud of myself today because. Um, from Sahara and I did some work there um, obviously no one is in the cafe it's not open I went to Tesco and then I also went to Pret um, and I'm just like, proud of myself because shopping is always such an ordeal and even just going to Tesco during the day I haven't done I think during this time because um, it just I'm just put off by the queue and the people and I would rather go in the evening but I went and it really wasn't that bad so I'll probably do it again. It was just nice to do something that felt normal again um, like the other day when we went to Wilco I was just looking at some cushions and frames and everything just felt very normal. I cannot tell you how much happier I am now that the sun is back. Thing I wanted to say is that um, during this time in lockdown, I felt myself wanting to move away from using social media as much, and um, I have been using it less. I feel like this has really helped me to be able to focus more on what I'm doing, on my work, and it's helped me to like hear my own voice more. And I realised that before, like I just remembered this, I would always have other people's voices in my head, like other people's opinions, what other people were doing, what people were thinking. I would have all of these things in my head because when I went on social media, that was what I saw, that was what I read, and some of these people, I don't even know them. I, I don't, I've never met them, but I had their voices in my head and I used to get so mad at myself and be like, why are you thinking about what this person is thinking or saying or doing? And I, you know, I didn't have my family's or my friends or my own voice in my head. I had voices of other people and it's just ridiculous. So this is one of the reasons why I wanted to using it so much and since I've done that I mean I have I can hear my own voice in the sense that you know I get up in the morning and I plan what I'm going to do for my day and I'm like okay I need to do this 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 and that's it and I do it and I don't think oh, what would this person think or that other people's opinions and voices and thoughts are just not there anymore. I just think about what do I need to do? Like, does this make me feel good? Okay, I'll do it. This doesn't make me feel good. Okay, I won't do it. And that's it. <laughs> that is so nice. Like, God, that's really scary when you think about it. But having all those other people's opinions in your head all the time is not healthy. And uh, you need to know what your own opinion is and what you want to do. When I go on Instagram now, it's just not as 
fun, I guess, as it were before, because like usually I'll just go on to post something and maybe reply to some messages um, and like I'll go to my friends' pages and stuff and see what they're doing, but sometimes I will scroll and start seeing other people's stuff again and I find myself getting more annoyed than usual at that because I'll be reading something that someone's posted and I'll just be like, why do I need to read this? Whereas before I would have been like, oh my god, let's see what this person is saying because I really respect their opinion and they might be saying something that I really need to take on board. Whereas now I'm just like, okay, that's what you think and that's your opinion and cool. Stay hydrated. studying. I really like these study videos because I have no friends. <laughs> I have no friends. So I just put this video on and like it's just there in the background. It's really relaxing. Thank you gutsy study girl. Hello, I've just been for a walk and I'm still wearing my jacket because I'm cold. Just a few um, thoughts. First of all, why is 3, 4pm the worst time of day? There have been articles written about this. The highlight of my week is I found a new tree. Back to downward dog. Now walk it out four times. Enjoy it. Body should be nice and warm now. Alright, heels down, lift the back leg, three legged dog.
just so you know, I I have first aid training, but it's out of date. So if you die, I can't help you. You are a cat. See, all these body balance classes are paying off. webinars and watch Columbo. <laughs> 